Hello and welcome to my new episode. After last week's episode on which we had a great time in Houston, now it is time to check out from the hotel and take our transport in order to join the ship. Enjoy the ride. Time to make a move. What do you think? Let's go. Hi, oh, you Gloria? Yeah. You're here to pick me up and take me to the ship? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. In the first minutes of meeting Gloria, we felt her positivity and warmth on which she passed over to us. People like her is difficult to find in these days. So Gloria is going to tell us about safety and shipping. Oh, you guys only have each other. You have to work with each other. I always tell my cadets, if you have any doubt for anything, you have to go to somebody and ask. If by the third contract as a cadet, it's, you don't feel it, then get out of it. Don't waste your time because it's not worth it. Because then they jeopardize the safety of everybody. That's right. If you don't like what you do, get out. It's either you're going to like it or you don't. You cannot say, ah, I'm only here for the money. No, you have to enjoy it. Yes, the money is the plus. But money is a necessity here on earth. It's not something that you take with you. I don't care how much money you have. When you die, you take one thing with you. It's your namesake. That's all you take with you. That's right. They're either going to say, oh, Captain Nico, what a good guy. You know? And they, everybody wants to work with Captain Nico. But if Captain Nico is not a good man, they're going to work bare minimum and they're not going to want to do anything for you. Even if you need them to work overtime, they don't have to. The ride became very, very interesting with Gloria. Here comes now Houston Center. Look at those skyscrapers, how tall they are. Wow, they look nice. Next time I may visit them. You have the hardest job that any human has? No, what do you do for the seamen? Oh, I pray for you all, all the time. I pray for you guys to go to your voyages safely, to come home to your family safely, because you only have each other and God. When you're in the middle of the sea and there's a storm coming through, you only have each other and God. And that's it. So I pray for y'all always. For God to always watch over you guys and protect you guys because y'all have the hardest job. I don't, you, you sacrifice, not only do you sacrifice, your families are sacrificed. Do you know the sacrifice that this captain made? To get to where he's at to make the twelve to fifteen thousand dollars a month that he makes, he had to stay away from his family and sacrifice his life so and work his butt off to get to where he's at so he can have it. Great. Listen, in Arabic we say, That means if it's like you eat onions in the beginning, meaning you have to work hard and sweat, but in the end get to that pot of honey, you get to enjoy the fruits of your labor. And this is what life is about. If you work hard, you get everything you want and everything you need. Really? That's not what God looks for. God looks for you being good to you, to your families, and good to the people who are in need. The more you give, the more you receive. How great was our ride today, meeting a wonderful person like Gloria. Wow, we've made a new friend here in Houston. She boosted our morale 
and of course she drove us nice and safely to our ship. This is a good thing that when you travel abroad you make new friends and it's an advantage while doing this job because you meet a variety of people worldwide. There she goes, a stunning beauty, a twin stroke LNG carrier. Let's go on board and have a look at her. And a message for a new crew joining a ship. Remember that smoking is not permitted inside the LNG terminal. The use of PPE is mandatory and all electronic devices such as mobile phones and smartwatches must be switched off. These can be used only in designated areas. Remember that the first priority when you join a ship is to familiarize with a vessel and give a call to your family members and say that you have arrived safely on board. The Ho Gannet is coming alongside to make fast on the other jetty and after that we will be sailing out to the uh, Gulf of Mexico. Right, the ship's engines are ready. The crew is standing by forward and aft. I believe we are ready to sail. Are you ready? Get set, let's go! So we are sailing, off we go to the channel. I hope you have enjoyed today's episode and it was quite short I admit, but I won't let you down. On our next episode I will be demonstrating out the familiarization which is carried out on board LNG carriers and of course the bridge and its equipment. So till next week. I wish you good health and see you next week. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Nick the Sailor Man, and I'll keep you posted. Cheerio!